Eiffel. London. 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 Eiffel. London. My name's Coon Cassius, this is Eiffel from London. We're at the Landmark Hotel. Here. With me, I've got Southern Area Champion, the new Southern Area Champion, Billy Joe Saunders. How are you, Bill? Yeah, I'm good, Coon. You're dressed very smartly today. Oh, listen, I like to put an occasion, don't I? I like just for the occasion, you've got to dress for it and. Uh, it's got me date again, the ninth, which I can't wait to get back out on, and uh, I think I'll be fighting Tony Hill. Has that been confirmed yet, or is that wait, waiting to be confirmed? Waiting to be confirmed, but I mean, he's he's got his chance now to 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 uh, cut apart up there, and I think he's definitely going to take it. He's a good fighter, but I think uh, I think I just might have a bit too much power for him. Um, have you watched your fight back with Gary Bolden? Yeah, yeah. Do you know what? I watched it back, and uh, I've learned from it already. Watching back little places where I should have pushed on that little bit harder and perhaps I could have got him out of there. But I'm pleased I got the 10 rounds over the moon. I got the 10 rounds now. It's in my head that I can go 10. If you can do 10, you can do 12. And uh, there's not that big a difference. And uh, I'm really, really pleased. After you've got this year out of the way, you're going to be pushing for that British title. Before the uh, Olympic Games, I will a million percent be British champion. Before the next Olympic Games, uh, that's what I set my sights on is the British title. And that's what I'll be getting. I mean, I hope Martin Murray wins out in Germany. It's a tough task, but, you know, best of luck to him. Anyway, I hope he do. But if he vacates the British, I'll be definitely in line for it. If not, I'll fight him for it. So. There's boys going through now with the Olympics, what you went through uh, a few years ago. Uh, what advice would you give to people that are, are competing from Britain in the Olympics next year? Well, it's a bit of a difference as well, really, because they've got the home support. But he's got to enjoy every single minute of it and... Uh, you know, we've got some good boys on the squad who's qualified already. Tom Stalker, really, really good prospect. I'm really right. I'm, I'm tipping him for gold. Um, you know, alongside with the others, you've got Joshua, the heavyweight, all really, really good prospects. But he's got to go out there and enjoy himself and take... Because, no, listen, there's not... You didn't, it's not every day someone goes to Olympic Games, you know, and it's, it's once in every four years it happens. It's not a possibility they're not going to hang around again for probably 2016. So you just got to enjoy every minute of it, really. Uh, you fought in Beijing, obviously the, the Olympics are here. How much of an advantage is that for the, the Olympians to be fighting on home territory? Big, big advantage. Uh, you know, to be honest, you look at some other nations when it's close, it's always going their way. With England, it's not it's not always the case really of England, but they've got the support behind them, you know, getting them up, geeing them up for it. And it, that's part of a good thing, you know. They're not going to be there missing their family and that because they're all going to be there supporting them and, that, and that's a big, big Real big boost for him. And just finally, what were your thoughts on uh, James Agale and George Groves sitting next to one another today at their press conference for the first time, really, since their post-fight? you got James and George, two really, really good fighters, you know, and uh, like I say, everybody wants it to happen again. But, you know, you can understand on George's point of view that it's his time and he away. And you can understand on James's point of view that he wants it now and he wants to get it on. But I mean, it's a good fight for everybody, isn't it? Fight fans and Box Nation, and that, that's what everybody wants to see it on again. And uh, I reckon it'll happen sooner rather than later. All right, Billy Joe Saunders, thank you very much for talking to iFilm London, and we'll catch up with you soon. This is Colin Cassius with Billy Joe Saunders for iFilm London. Thank you very much. I feel London. 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 I feel London, London, London.